Hello again, my name is Emma, and yes, we are doing a Dollar Tree haul today. <laughs> Not a big one, because you know me, I'm like, I only get what I really need. I don't get items like for light fixtures or makeup and nail polish, things like that, because I really, I, like right now, I did do my nails, but I, I have a lot of nail polish. Why am I going to buy more nail polish? I have all the colors I need, so why am I going to buy more? Um, I mean, hey, more kudos to you if you want to have 100 and 200 different colors of nail polishes. M more power to you, but me, I, I'm like, I wash so many dishes that half the time, I'm like, I don't even want nail polish on my hands. The only reason I wear black, and that's because I dye my hair, and when I dye my hair, the the color that I use on my head, it goes on my fingertips, and you can see the black on my nails when when I when they're not colored. So to avoid that, until I get hair dye, I color my fingernails black and then when I get hair color for about the only last like maybe like about mm, I don't know a week four maybe three four weeks maybe three weeks the grays start coming out and then when I do the hair color then I can wear whatever color nail polish I want but then again I really don't even use it because I'm, I'm a homebody, so I really don't really go out anywhere too much. So um, I'm trying to change that. I want to be able to go out more, but yeah, it costs money to go out. <laughs> My name's Emma. I got a Jewish name. What do you want me to say? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> don't hurt me for that. Anyway, um, but um, yeah. So, I mean, I do do my nails every once. It's like we're wearing earrings. I don't wear earrings because even if I wear earrings, you can't see them. So, why bother? Okay, anyway, let's get to this haul. Okay, so I did get some of these, um, what were they? Pop dot adhesives. So, I did get these. I uh, know you can really see them. I'm going to try to, yeah, there they are. So I did get a pack of these, okay? These are really cool to use when you're trying to do a pop-up. But I really don't like pop-ups on my cards. It all depends on what I need. I usually do it if I'm putting something on my wall, like here or on my wall. That's when I'll use these. Or for some reason, I need something tiny. That's when I'll use these. So I got those. And I did see the Crafty Girl, Marie. She hauled, uh, she saw these, um, oh, what are they, uh, stamps, and I was like, oh, and she, and she didn't grab them, and I was shocked that she didn't grab them, and I was like, but those are stamps, those are like, you know, from the Dollar Tree, to know that they have stamps like that, it's like, get them, get them, because you could always use them instead of buying them later on. You can make your own uh, ephemera. So she did, this This is the pack that she showed. And I was, and it was like for Valentine's Day. And believe me, at my Dollar Tree, I rarely, I mean really rare, rarely see this. Although I already made a few prints on my own, but I don't have the jar. Uh, did I, I, I? I think I have the mailbox, but I'm not sure. But the thing is, with these guys, you could always make your own prints, like seriously. Um, and you don't, I mean, because, well, okay, here's the thing. Once you print this on anything, whether it's, pink black whatever color you still have to color it in so it's better for you to make your own prints and have a collection you could print them out as and you don't have to go crazy trying to find where's my stamp because you already have it in your 
printable stash. All you have to do is, is print it, color them, and have a, like 2,000 of each of them. <laughs> I'm just kidding. At least 50, 50, 25. Let's go down. You'll have 25 of each print already colored, already done, ready to slap adhesive on a card and you're and you're done so but I, you know i saw it now i like i mean like the tim holtz oh my god the the tim holtz stamps i'm like oh my or die cuts i don't know what this guy does all day but he must be like creating stuff all day because his die cuts are like to die for to die for ah! okay but anyway i love watching him anyway when i saw this and she just passed by and I was, oh, why didn't you grab that? And I was like, if I see it. But to me, I said, most likely, knowing my Dollar Tree, I won't have it. I won't, I won't see it. It's like this coloring book that she shows. And it's about a bedroom, furniture. I've been looking for that coloring book and I can't find it. I even went to Walmart and I still don't see it. No. <laughs> That's okay. I'll find one online. And I'll print it out, whatever, or trace it, whatever, and I'll color it. Probably being small. But anyway, I got that. I was really happy to see it. <laughs> I'm like, yes. Okay, I did get another one. And this was, um, yeah, I'm all about crafts. I'm not really too much into makeup. Um, like I said, all the other things like treats and food and stuff like that. Although I did get some food. I did get some food. I'm not going to lie. So then I got this one. It was summer and I love, I don't know what it is about flamingos. But I love flamingos. Sunflowers and flamingos. I just love it. I don't know why. So I got this one. This was like a beach theme. Does it have a flamingo in here? Yes. No, it has a duck. Okay, we're going to go for ducks then. Oh, I love that. See that little, with the little umbrella? Ooh, yum. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we're going to have a good time with this one. <laughs> cards, guys. Just cards. Okay. And then I did buy this one. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this one. Now, these guys are good if you're traveling because, I don't know. At one time, I had a party. And this was with my a girlfriend of mine from years I'm gonna say not year I'm gonna say decades because it's been decades and we had an awesome time and all we did was play cards we drank beer and we had a great time I think we were playing rummy but this is the kind of game that you can do the same thing with and it, it listen to music you're gonna have a, a gay old time just don't drink too much, especially if you have to go home and drive. Don't do it. Don't do it. But, yeah. So, um, if you have, because even if you want to travel with something like this, this will fit in your suitcase, like, so comfortably. Like, really. It's not like a big board game. This will fit really awesome in your suitcase. But I didn't buy it for the game. I bought it four and it has all the pieces in there it has all the pieces okay they had candy land they had all that but i'm i you know we have we have um monopoly the regular one we have well i don't have the kids have the grandkids have um the simpsons and i don't know something else i don't know anyway and then they have all the little, the little, the little cards. Okay. That's not what I bought it for. I bought it for, then here's the board. And I really hope the kids didn't, didn't come in here. Because I bought it. Oh, here it is. I, oh, everything's falling on the, out on the other side. I bought it. No other than for this the money I'm like oh my god I want that money oh and look at the dice I'm going 
going to buy another one just for the kids or just to have. If I want to have a gay old time with my girlfriends, I don't have to bring a big box. It'll just be this, this tiny little box. <laughs> we're going to have a, we're going to have a hoot of a time. But it was the money. That's, I wanted it for the money to do junk journaling with. And I was like, <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> so I got that. Let me see if I can put all this back. I love the board. Hmm. Slice this baby up. But I'm not going to do that. I mean, I should, but I'm not. Well, unless I get another one, then I will. <laughs> okay. So I got that. <laughs> okay. Uh, what else did I get? Okay, so I have been looking into, oh my God, making cozies. And every time I go to the microwave and I get something out that I heated up, I'm always burning my hands. And I was watching, I don't know who I was watching. Little Brit? Little Brit. Anyway, she was talking about cozies. And I have seen cozies before. But I just never really, really, she was talking about how she does um, um, craft fairs and how, you know, she makes these cozies, she sells them, whatever. But I was like, at that time, for some reason, I was microwaving something, something and it was so hot that I was like, oh my God, I'm burning my hands and I had to grab a towel. But then I thought of her. And she was talking about the cozies. And I was like, I want some cozies too. <laughs> I can use a few of those. So, you know me. Or you know any crafter. Once they see something, they're going to try to replicate the darn thing. So, it's just like my what do you call my shamrock little guy. I made a little shamrock because I seen this person made a little tea. Oh, it was so beautiful. So beautiful. But th this is really, really artistic. He had a little tea cup and he painted like a scenery. I don't know who it was. I don't remember. A scenery in the little tea. And now it wasn't a cup. It was a teapot. And I was like, oh. That is so gorgeous. But I did my own because I love I love putting things. I love putting my keys and stuff in things. Like like I have earrings. Hold on. I had earrings that I crocheted. It's crocheted. Uh, you can see it. Okay. Anyway. And um I, have my, I should put my little shamrock. I found my little shamrock. Hold on. I found my little shamrock earrings. I was so happy. Anyway, I love putting keys and stuff and things like this. But, you know, I like to have something more, like, for the holiday. So, I made a shamrock little dish. It wasn't perfect. It was my first time out. So, but I love it. And I put my keys, I put my keys in here. And I don't know where my keys are at right now, but anyway. So, that's what I look like doing. And I said, hey, you know what, I can do that. And we always we always seem to replicate whatever the other people do and stuff like that. So, I was like, let me give it a go. And so, um, just like this one. This is a little shamrock magnet. And it has a magnet. You can stick it on your fridge or whatever. Anyway, so I saw the cozy. And I was like, I need a few of those because every time I go into the microwave and get a dish out, I'm always burning my hands. I have to use a towel. So I got three. Woody, and I was watching Gemini, the crafty Gemini, the crafty Gem. Gem oh, I, her name is Gemini. And she made a whole bunch of them hers, but she had hers a little bit more rounded. I mean, it's a process. I'm not, I'm not saying you could do this like in in a half an hour. It, it, it's gonna, it, it's a process. It's gonna take you a couple of hours. But I bought these, and I wanna see if I can make, I'm gonna try one. I'm gonna use this one. 
and then these because she said you could make them out of out of uh, fat quarters. Now it's like, <gasps> well, let me hurry up and buy them. The only thing that I haven't been able to find, and that's the batting. So I'm, I'm probably going to have to order that one online. So I'm hoping, if anything, if I can just make one cozy, I'll be the happiest person in the world. I don't have to burn my hands anymore. Okay, so I got that at Dollar Tree. And then I got, now the reason I'm trying to get little things um because i have i'll say okay so let me because i did go to family dollar too not not only dollar tree okay so i went to i'm trying to figure out what i want what i got okay at uh, at dollar tree and then what I got at Family Dollar, okay? So, okay. So I always need Vaseline, like for everything, like for, you know, when you have your rub, you know, your, your rough edges on your elbows or the back of the the ankles or your feet behind your feet. You, you get to that age, guys, girls, men. I don't know. You're gonna get to that age. You want to soften that stuff up. So I always need Vaseline. So I did get Vaseline. Again, get what you need. Okay. And I did get. Um, I'm making this package for a friend, and I said, but I need more pink stuff. So I got this little pink little foo foo. Oh, what? I don't know what the hell you call these. There's what? What do they call? Let's find out. Uh, oh, a sponge. <laughs> okay, it's so simple. A sponge thing. I thought it was cute. And then I got her a bath fizzer. Okay. And then I got some feminine, feminine cleansing wipes. Now, again, guys, you can get all this, everything that's pink. Everything that's a green, everything that's a blue, everything that's orange. And put it all together and make a gift basket or, or um, a gift bag. Any, as long as you know what they need or, or what you think they might need, okay? So I'm going to put putting all this together and... It's gonna, I'm just one, I just want to bless her with it. So that's awesome. And I got another, um, this, well, this is what I got from Dollar Tree. Okay. I have to put it all the way. Oh my God, I have to fix all that. I did see a piece of squeeze sweet tomato basil from Contadina. So it's supposed to be like four pizza. Now I have little pizza. What happened was that. My oven is not working. It's not broke. I don't want to say that it's broke. It's just not working. I had to replace the igniter, so I had to order that. So it doesn't seem like a real hard process. I already looked it up. I can do that. <laughs> just give me pray that I don't blow up the <laughs> blow up the kitchen, okay? But it looks kind of looks simple enough. Okay, so I do have an air fryer, and you can make pizza. In an air fryer and I was like okay so I saw this at Dollar Tree and I grabbed it and it's because all I have to get because I have I don't think I want to make pizza dough. I know how to make pizza dough that's no problem but I could always get those little pizza um gyro gyro little breads I mean I don't know I mean I could I mean I I shouldn't be lazy, but I do need more of uh, the King the King Authors uh, bread. That's the kind of bread, flour that you need to make the piece of dough, bread dough. It comes out perfect. I might have a little bit left. I don't know. I don't know. If not, I'll buy some more. But anyway, you could also use the gyro um, little breads. And you could put this on, you know, that. And I already have the sausage. I already have the mozzarella cheese. So, there you go. Little pieces. The only thing is, is that, you know, I can't cook like four at a time. I have to cook one at a time. So that might take, you know, a, a, that's going to be a process. But I don't know. 
I did make a cake that came out good. I was happy with that because I was determined to make a cake and my oven wasn't working and I was like ready to be in tears because I was like, I can't, I need my oven. <laughs> we cannot be with our oven, like really. And, but there's always alternatives and in this, in a, this day and age, I mean, you could make a, a, a cake in a little oven, but usually the little ovens are not that, they're like rectangle, rectangular, and they're not round. So, I don't know if it would fit my little spring forms would fit in there. Anyway, it doesn't matter because I already packed it up. <laughs> anyway, I don't even use it. I use it for my polymer clay and everything like that. Anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, so, I did use the air fryer. The cake came out perfect. It, no, well, not perfect, but it came out. But I definitely want to try this. And oh, let me tell you something. I got something else to I got peanuts. Now, I'm not always into buying food at Dollar Tree. Okay, I am not. I mean, like, really rare. I usually stick to craft items. But, but or things I'm going to put together for, for as a gift. But when I saw these little guys, I was like, oh, I I really, really like peanuts. I really do. And they had the regular, but this one had honey roasted and they were $1.25. And I was like, oh, I'm getting it. I want it. I'm getting it. But they have, the thing is they have so much food. They have so much little food that you could, oh my God, guys, you could make an array, a basket, a bag, a box of Little items, cereal, coffee, sugar, treats, um, sauces, you name it, and put it as a little gift box or a gift bag or whatever and give it as a gift. Guys, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I like getting things. I don't mind getting things. But every now and then, having these little things in your cupboard, you can make any late night snack that you want. You get the, well, I'm not, you know, you get hungry. <laughs> and you want to nibble on something, you put a little this and this together, and you have all these little items in your cupboard or your fridge or whatever, and you're good to go. These guys, these little guys are amazing. We didn't have this back in the 30s or 40s. Everything was big, but now everything's going small, which Times are changing, guys. Just be be aware the times are changing. Um, if you need to look up about stocking up for, you know, any kind of recession that we may might be going through in the future, near future, unfortunately, uh, beans is one of them. So stock up on beans, rice, and all that kind of stuff. Cause uh, yeah, we just never know. You just never know. And water. Okay, guys. But yeah. <laughs> I love peanuts. <laughs> okay, so that's what I got for Dollar Tree. Okay, so I did go to Family Dollar. And um, I did see these little guys at Family Dollar. And the cute little bunnies. Little carrots. And these were a dollar. Okay, if I go to Dollar Tree, they would have been a dollar twenty-five, But they were a dollar. So I was really happy with that. Okay, oh no, no, wait. I got one more thing at Dollar Tree. And I was like, no. <laughs> I was so upset. Because at uh, Family Dollar, I got these guys. And they're like little dish towels. Dish towels, okay? And the thing is, I always have this one dish towel, and it's like gray. And it has like this knit, net behind it. And I love it because it scours my table because syrup, egg, milk, and it scours, it could scour my table clean, so I always use it. But when I went to Family Dollar, they didn't have it. All they had was just a very, very, I don't know if you can see it, mesh, kind of mesh thing. And I said, well, I need them, I'm gonna get it. And I gotta get black because white turns black, like, you know, dirt, black, It's go. they go together. They, I, I don't know what industrial thing they use to clean, you know, towels white, but I only have ble bleach and, and, and never wear 
barely works. So I said, I'm getting black. So I got two of these and these were only a dollar. Only a dollar. Okay. So I got that at Family Dollar. But I did go to Dollar Tree and I saw a towel. And I said, oh, I can use that. Because again, the towel that's on top of my air fryer is white and it's already turning gray. But then I looked up and I saw the same dish towels with the net that I have in my kitchen. And I was like, that's what I was looking for. But it was $1.25 just for one. At Family Dollar, I got two for one. Uh, but I still want the other one. <laughs> I really like that net. But anyway, that's, that's the other thing I got at Family Dollar. Um, then, of course, I got some peeps for my grandson because he loves peeps. He really does. And I have bought some snacks for my other two grandchildren. They're not really into these, but he is. And then I bought him, because they didn't have Cheetos. And I was like, but every time I get a big, big bag of Cheetos, you know, it's like, I always have to put them in small little bags just for him. So I said, well, let me just find a little, I don't want a lot of Cheetos, I just want a little bag for him. So I hope he likes the Doritos. So I got him Doritos. So, you know, just trying to make them all happy. That's all I can do is make them, you know, happy. Happy, happy, happy. And um, make sure they do all their work, homework, stuff like that. And um, which they all have good grades. They all have, you know, they're all always like either A's and B's or on the honor roll. So. I'm happy with that. Okay, guys, so that's what I did today. And I'm so happy. I finally went to Dollar Tree. Although I did not find that book that Marie, the crafty girl, always shows. And I even went to Walmart to try that, find that coloring book. And it was like a bedroom. I don't know. It was furnishings. I don't know what it was. But she was like, oh, I got to color. No, I to color that too. But if I can't find it, I don't know. It's it's always, th those kind of books are always a hit and miss. But if I can't find it, I'll just Google it or, you know, whatever. I got enough stuff that I have to color as it is. So <laughs> I'm like, I need to get on it. I need to get on it. But okay, guys, so that was my tr Dollar Tree haul. Hope you liked it. And uh, yeah, so like a fish in the sea. So glad you caught me, and like always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and definitely comment. Okay, guys, we will see you. I know I have been MIA for a few of my videos, but I'm like, oh, things happen. Can't always be on here, so it is what it is, and I'll be on here when I can. I'll try, and um, I did get some coupons. I'm hoping I'll be able to do a couponing haul next week i had to use all of my coupons and my extra buck uh care bucks and my um my care pass because we were down to the bare minimum and i had no choice but to use them for other things other than things <laughs> so it helped me so glad i'm into the program it saved me it really did save me and i'm so grateful for cvs for that so okay Anyway, okay, hopefully next week it'll be different. <laughs> it won't be food. It'll be items. <laughs> okay, guys, so hopefully I got them. Go look, see what's out there, because I really do need mascara and hair color. Not my hair color. <laughs> okay, guys, we'll see you later. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and definitely comment.